Hello everyone, this is Amrita and welcome to my cooking blog Amrita's Canteen. Today I am going to share with you all caramel pudding with caramel decoration. So without wasting much time, let's start. So first take milk 500 ml on a heavy bottom pan and start stirring, bring it to boil. You have to keep stirring continuously otherwise it can stuck to the bottom. For 7 minutes on high flame you have to keep stirring. Now here I am adding sugar, 3 tablespoon of sugar. You can add 4 tablespoon of sugar also if you want sugar more but as my preference I want sugar 3 tablespoon only. Again for another 5 minutes you have to keep stirring. Now cool down completely. Now here I am coming to the second part of the liquid. So here I am going to take eggs. No, not six. I need only three eggs here. Yes. One. Uh, two. Here it is. And three. Okay. Now remove this one and start whisking the egg. So here I am taking 3 eggs only, I am showing all the measurement for 500 ml of milk. It's ready and keep it aside. Now coming to the third part of the liquid and it's corn flour. Here I am taking 2 tablespoon of corn flour and 1 tablespoon of water and mix it well. The corn flour should not make any lump. Yeah, it's ready. Now all three part of the mixture is ready and I am going to add all these three things together. The milk, egg and corn flour or cornstarch. Now give it a light mix and keep it aside. Now coming to the top layer of caramel. So here I am taking 3 tablespoon of sugar and 1 and half tablespoon of water. Do not stir this sugar and water mixture with spoon or ladle just keep it like this on high flame making caramel is little tricky but don't worry i will tell you step by step procedure first let the sugar dissolve and wait for that you have to be very patient while making caramel keep doing this move the pan but do not use any spoon or ladle bubble on on low flame of course now as you can see this liquid starts changing color light golden color is coming so you have to turn off the gas at this level you will get the desired caramel color after turning off the gas from the hot pan itself now take a steel tiffin box pour hot caramel and immediately start spreading you have to work with very hot and liquid caramel once the caramel cools down it will become hard candy impossible to work with now pour the liquid pudding mix into the steel bowl or solid steel box here i am taking a heavy bottom pot and i am pouring water and placing the tiffin box at the middle covering it up do not close the lid too tightly otherwise it will be impossible for you to open it up. Water should not leak inside the box. Now keep it on steam for 25 minutes on low flame. Now coming to the caramel decoration. I am going to make a fresh batch of caramel for this. So I am taking this time sugar half cup and water 1.5 tablespoon. Follow the same process as earlier. Let the sugar dissolve again, wait very patiently and do not go anywhere, so keep standing in front of the gas. As you can see it started changing color, light golden color is coming and it's ready, turn off the gas. Cool down slightly but you cannot work this time with the caramel, it's very thin and very hot also. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel Old School Buddies and click on the bell icon to get the latest video. So here you can see 
the caramel is changing its color and texture you have to keep checking with a spoon now i think it's ready it's little thick and we can start working with it so one parchment paper you can make any design what you want to make here i am making some net and here it is be very very careful while working with hot caramel it's very hot and it can burn your hands move the parchment paper slowly and make any design any shape whatever you want to make and believe me it's really fun to work with hot caramel kids please stay away from hot caramel it's quite dangerous for kids to work with hot caramel without adults supervision now let it dry for 5 minutes and slowly pull it out from the parchment paper it will come easily as you can see and but you have to be very patient again i'm telling you see now time to unmold my pudding is ready i'm tapping softly and tap softly at the back and here it is dun dun ah wow pure beauty here i am fixing the sugar net you have to be very careful while fixing the sugar net otherwise it can break now it's ready and i am going to use the other caramel decoration for some shot here it is thank you for watching bye bye love you